hey guys welcome welcome back to the channel so my name is phyllis if you're new here and in today's video i just want to show you what we did so we finally have a new fridge and this was the process of us getting the fridge so we went and looked around first we went to garden city there's a hot point shop over there so the plan wasn't actually to get the fridge on this day it was we were just going to check out what they had because we had been moving around uh in supermarkets and we were not finding what we actually wanted and we weren't sure about what we were going to get but we settled our mind when we came here so also decided to look at their washing machines which are quite expensive i'll say but you can see the brands it's samsung and the other one the lg and the bosch i don't know how you pronounce that but yeah i guess bosch so yeah you can see the prices guys the prices were insane so there's a price that i actually saw and i was like this can't be realistic because it was almost half a million kenyan shillings like I'm like someone is going to get that washing machine anyways if you have the money why not so checked out the microwaves as well and the cookers also everything is so expensive even the cookers from 41,000 like I didn't see anything less than 30,000 there was nothing like that but they do look good with the good thing about cookers it's kind of hard for them to like spoil or something that's what I mean uh, it takes a really bad brand for a cooker to be to spoil as fast as a fridge can that's what i'm saying so i think cookers are more long lasting than fridges so yeah i was just showing you guys the lipam dogum dogo plan they have that for they say they have that for like all appliances so you can go and check them by check them out i think they also have they have like another another store somewhere else i don't remember where so over here i was looking at op the options i had so i was going to choose between the samsung i was confused between getting the samsung and the bush because they were like the two fridges that i actually really liked and i loved so they explained what the fridge is all about and i asked a lot of questions a lot of them especially about the compressor thing i didn't know about like fridges and compressors yeah i know it's silly but yeah honestly i didn't know like the other fridge i realized that was that was the issue the compressor anyway i also showed you the air fryers as you can see in case you want to stop by and get one or save up for one because they are a bit expensive especially these bigger brands they are quite expensive others are going for let's say 40,000 30,000 so yeah you save up I'm a Kukula Chama you go get one and then I was looking for coffee makers I was just taking pics because I want to like upgrade to a better a better one yeah an espresso machine so hopefully not soon not now it's not in a i'm not in a hurry because i actually prefer black coffee but yeah when i do get the money so guys our fridge is finally here that's how it looks on the side anyway this is the other fridge don't mind what i'm wearing anyway this is the other one the old one that's how short it is let me stand over here so that you can see the difference that's the difference guys the new one is pretty big and it looks very good for that space i love 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 it oh my god i also love the fact that i didn't want a fridge with this handles anymore this is how i wanted it yeah so i done with this one anyway so let me show you guys the inside so they said i wait for eight hours before i remove this ones in case anything goes wrong so eight hours before i turn it on anyway this is how it looks on the inside this is the freezer which is quite big 
let me compare it to the old freezer that's the old freezer guys there was just this over here which wasn't actually useful at all it's quite small yeah but it was also working perfectly and this is the new freezer so i can fit a lot of stuff over here just so let me finish i can fit a lot of stuff over here and over here so yeah and then they say this one helps with the cooling so when the lights are off it helps like keep the meals what keep 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 the meals fresh for a while before the lights are back so it's just going to stay there i guess and i have this space over here for the fridge compartment that's how it looks pretty big okay so we have this over here we have a shelf here we have another one here mm -hmm. and then we have this one over here the fresh box i'll show you guys when we open it when we unwrap it and then just can you excuse please and then on the door that's how it looks jason don't put anything for now wait that's how it looks on the door it has a lot of space i have all this i have this i have this and it's actually like already organized so i can like put drinks and they have this small one for eggs i show them how the fridge looks on the inside excuse them they can't see with you there okay guys that's how it looks from here and as i told you guys it's quite is it long or tall yeah now let me open the other one just an excuse yep. let me open the small one i haven't yet cleaned it just one get out get out this is how the other one looked it was also quite good on the inside it looks very pretty it's not that old it's only like two years old we haven't used it for like that long it was also very special. I like the shelves as well. Anyway, so that's how I looked. Jason, can you excuse me? Yeah. Now let me show you from afar how they both look from here. That's how they look. You can see there's a big difference, a very huge difference from here. But my god, I just love the new one. Okay, let me close it now. Shit. Okay. <coughs> So that's how the fridge looks guys that's how they both look i don't know it's, it's gray it's gray yes. oh sorry i didn't know anyway like days later after getting the fridge so we have been using it now for like let's say four days and this is how it looks for now so this is the this is what i have left so i, I had put our yogurt over here and i still have a lot of space this is my son's like area these are my son's favorite drinks so yeah that's how it looks on the door and i have a lot of space because you can like push everything behind wherever you want it and the space down here also have space i just don't want to like fill the fridge up with junk or anything so and then here just i'm going to get more organizers like this one so on that one i just have fruits and stuff so yeah down there that's how it looks ah it's a bit colder as you can see because the settings for here are different from the settings for the fridge so here are the settings for the fridge so if i want to change them i just press fridge and i pick whatever i want so now we are at four degrees celsius and then there we have different settings so so that's what i have 
in the and some cheese so let me show you from here and then for this one i have tomatoes i have carrots i have a bell pepper this one is kale that i prepped and i have beetroots then they have leftovers and eggs pineapples over there and that's how their freezer looks i hadn't done like any meal prep or anything so this was just stuff that a bit of stuff that we had gotten for the for breakfast and some meat for the week so that's how it looked and it has a lot of space i must admit i tried to fit in my containers and they fit perfectly so this is enough for us for a freezer since we are just a family of three so we don't need a lot of space so that works for us and if it doesn't i can get a freezer in future so anyway this guys was the next day and yeah i decided to start up breakfast with you guys so it was over the weekend it was on saturday and we were all spending the day at home and yeah so i started off with coffee i love coffee in the morning yeah black one i'm trying to change from coffee with sugar to coffee black coffee without sugar but i'm going to be honest with you guys that's the one thing that i can't and i have tried and i'm not doing it again it's nasty and it's not tasty i don't understand why i should drink coffee without sugar it doesn't make sense because it's not that tasty so yeah i'm sticking to coffee with sugar I prefer it that way, yeah. They say that you'll know when you've met them somehow. I'm not sure when. about me but when i wake up in the morning my heart's empty i may just have really high hopes but i know what i feel some people just want
soon I'll be over the moon How long's it So after uh, breakfast, I didn't want to stay with dirty dishes in the sink. So I decided to clear my sink out because I love a clean sink. So just doing the morning dishes and the few bowls and plates that I had gotten the previous day. I'm trying to add more plates and more bowls because I have more cups than I have plates or anything. I used to buy a lot of cups a while back when i used to go shopping i would always get two and it became a habit and before i knew it i had a lot of them so i didn't do that with anything else so for now i don't have plates and we always break like every month i think uh two plates break in this house and it's not usually me who breaks them it's either my son or his dad it's not me yeah so I need to get some more. Since I have the cups, I don't want to get like the whole set. The one that comes with cups and whatever. I just want to pick them out. Yeah. Each piece. Pick whatever I want. Yeah. I'm not like really trying to go with a certain color or anything. Anything that I think looks cute, that's what I'm going to be getting. Yeah. Just wants to consume me I can feel you when you're miles away I don't take chances But today is the day, babe See, I'm not afraid to say it You have all the power But you care enough to share it with me See, I'm not afraid to show it i mm -hmm. 
So my son asked for popcorn and yeah, that's what we made. He wanted caramel popcorn and I didn't have the packed ones that I usually get from the supermarket and I wish I had the caramel syrup, but I didn't. I ended up making the plain ones anyway. Also, I had to make my fresh juice. I love this one so much. I make it weekly. I have to take it weekly. It's healthy and it's tasty. So I use carrots, beetroots, pineapples or tangerines sometimes when I have tangerines. So if I use tangerines, I won't use pineapple. If I use a pineapple, I'm not going to use tangerine. And it's quite, quite tasty and healthy. I already said that. Anyway, guys, given that today is Valentine's Day, I hope you guys have a good one. I love you, love you guys. In case no one has told you they love you, I hope mine still counts. I love you and I appreciate you. So have fun today. For the single girls, single ladies, it's okay. 
loving yourself still counts so celebrate yourself no one can love you more than you love yourself that is a fact and you shouldn't expect anyone to love you more than you love yourself anyway i'll see you on my next video next week and thank you for stopping by if you like my content please don't forget to subscribe and get to give it a like and comment down below so yeah see you soon Just one